Hey folks, Alex McMahon here of Evolve Nutritional Therapy. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my 8th out of 9 tips to sustainable fat loss. Tip number 8 is going to be to consume healthy fats. Healthy fats, by my standards, are the ones that come from nature. These are things such as coconut oil, grass-fed butter, tallow or lard raised from sustainable grass-fed or pasture-raised animals, avocado oil, olive oil, olives, avocados, nuts, seeds, and things like that. The, four, the fats that you're going to want to try to avoid are going to be the hydrogenated, partially hydrogenated oils, any kind of vegetable or shortening, and then also soybean oil and canola oil. So the reasons that you're going to want to try to avoid these is because, number one, they're very highly processed. Number two, they have a very um, unbalanced omega-3 anti-inflammatory to inflammatory omega-6 fatty acid balance. They're very high in the omega-6, so therefore they're inflammatory oils. And also, they're much easier, they're much more easily damaged by heat and by light. So when you cook with these oils, such as soybean oil or canola oil, they become much more carcinogenic, and they're also very easily damaged by the heat that you use them with. Now, back to the reasons why fat can actually help you lose fat. One of the big reasons is that from a physiological standpoint, fat slows the gastric emptying of food from your stomach. That means that instead of getting large peaks and valleys from a very dense source of carbohydrates, you'll be getting a low, slow-rolling, more sustainable burning of energy when you switch over to using fats for fuel. Another advantage to fat is that it's less easily stored as body fat. Because carbohydrates are a sugar, they're very easily stored as body fat, whereas fats go through a different process and are much more difficult to store. Also, one of the big reasons that you want to try to get a certain percentage of fats in your diet is because it helps to make up our cell membranes. It also helps to make up a certain percentage of your sex-driven hormones, such as testosterone and estrogen. And also, fat just tastes great. Um, one of the big things is that from a long, for, for a long period of time, we have had fat in our diet. It's only once we removed fat from our diet and started to replace it with sugar that we've gotten sicker and, unhe and unhealthier and suffered a number of health problems. When you get carbohydrates low enough, and sugar, and you get enough fat in your diet, you can kick yourself into a fat burning mode known as ketosis. Ketosis is essentially running off of the byproducts of your body um, metabolizing your body fat and your dietary fat. A lot of people use it with great success to achieve um, rapid fat loss, and there are even some very cool neurological and health benefits that go along with it. So, if you'd like to learn more, or if you'd just like to contact me, you can always find me at evolvent.pdx at gmail.com. My Instagram is Evolve Nutritional Therapy. My website is evolvenutritionaltherapy.com. And my Twitter is evolvent.pdx. Take care, and tip number nine coming at you soon.